I'm at Smart Industry 2018. I'm talking to Dave Sutton, Marketing Manager for Automating Products at Schneider Electric. Dave, can you tell us about the new uh, Schneider Electric M580 safety, please? Absolutely, yes. Well, let's have a look at the uh, demonstration equipment and I'll talk you through it. The first thing I perhaps mention about the M580 is the fact that we introduced the notion of fault tolerance. So as opposed to a system failing and failing in a safe way, we have the reassurance, the added high availability on the M580. Different levels of hot standby come in. We see this on the, on the processor. So here we have a primary and a secondary processor. In the event of a failure on the primary, then the system carries on. The safety function continues in place. And this is important for process industries, more critical applications, where there's not just a risk of personnel safety, but there's a risk of potentially explosion or spillage, uh, plant-wide um, damage or hazard, or even to the greater environment. So that's where we talk about a need for a higher availability of fault tolerance. As far as the 580 is concerned here, you see on the rack in front of you a mixture of red hardware, which is the safety-related hardware, but in the same architecture, we also see some white non-safe hardware. The M580 supports a technology called Common Safety, which does exactly that. It allows us to manage our safe application and our non-safe application on the same platform with the same configuration environment. It allows us to benefit from a simplified environment, perhaps a smaller footprint, and certainly the engineering, the ongoing maintenance is made easier because we're talking about one system rather than two systems. Moving on, the other key point about the 580 that we see here is that it's no longer related just to machine safety. Some of the examples that we saw earlier, the emergency stop, the light curtains, the machine guard controls and limit switches as well. What we have here with the 580 is also certification, TUV certification for process safety. So we have a couple of actuators here. These are um, temperature transducers which are bringing in analog uh, parameters into the system which allows us to move into the realms of process safety for such examples as emergency shutdowns or burner management systems or fire and gas monitoring so it does deliver a holistic approach to safety we can look at this as one system now it's doing our safe it's doing our non-safe it's doing our machine safety and it's doing our process safety all on one application I'll just finish off, I think, here as well by, by saying that the M580 safety is based on the architecture of EPAC technology. The non-safe M580 is, is, is where this has come from. And a couple of key points to point out. We're Ethernet backpane based. So the volume of data, the bandwidth of data that these EPAC controllers can manage is unprecedented in today's environment. And the second key point about the EPAC technology is we have the Achilles Level 2 certification. So uh, extra layers of security, robustness to, if you like, minimise the risk of unauthorised access to the control system. Dave, how is Schneider Electric supporting the new M580 safety with configuration tools and documentation? There's a number of different things actually, yes, we, we support the full TUV certification, data and reports are available. Uh, we have tools like we're showing on the, on the screen here, um, Ecostructure Modicon Builder tool which allows us to easily configure a PLC architecture. It's great because it checks the uh, accuracy of the architecture, it'll make sure that we've got all the right cable connections, accessories, terminal blocks and it'll generate a bill of materials and a bid quotation tool as well. Another thing I'd like to show you, a suite of TVDAs, Tested Validated Documented Architectures. This particular one talks about safety and it takes you through the full discussion around a hazardous assessment, safety calculations and how to implement a machine safety application or a process safety application in a nice concise document.